The effects of the recent government shutdown are still being felt by area families. Students at one area high school are stepping up to help their peers. Chris 6 News anchor Priscilla Torres shows us more. Seniors at Flower Bluff High School and members of the Key Club, Chance Pittman and Thomas Nelson, have created a food pantry at their school. So I want to be a friend and, um, and, you know, help out anybody who is in need. Yeah, we're looking for stuff, um, you know, like ready to eat, I guess, like, you know, ramen noodles, uh, oatmeal, raviolis, stuff like that. Just heat up. That food is available only to students to take home for them and their families or a student who didn't have breakfast that day or doesn't have money for lunch. Kind of started when the government shut down and we have a lot of military here. So we were just trying to make sure that those kids didn't do without and didn't have to struggle. The high school offered the Key Club space near the counselor's office to stock their food pantry and also give students in need privacy when they come in. The Key Club volunteers throughout the year and they hope that the food pantry continues and grows for other students. And I'd like to be able to add like water and electric so that they'd have a washer and dryer because I know some kids here like always want to, hey, I need to wash my work uniform because there's a lot of kids at work and don't always have access to that. I mean, one of my things going into it, I said, um, any hornet going home hungry, you know, is one too many hornets. And like I said, everyone here is family, and I want to help um, ensure that, that we um, all stay tight and work together and, um, you know, keep each other, you know, safe and sound and happy, right? Priscilla Torres, Chris, 6 News. Well, good job to those young men. Now, the Flower Bluff Key Club is still in need of donations. If you'd like to help, you can drop off non-perishable food items at the Flower Bluff High School's receptionist desk.